Welcome to the third online tutorial about the first worksheet. In this third exercise, we have to draw a triangle with three given points. After that, we have to color certain sides in different colors. After that, we have to enter the equation of a parabola, plot it, and then have it intersect the triangle. Finally, we want to find the distance between the two intersection points. We start again by using the coordinate axes, view, axes, and enter the three points. A. In order to enter the points, we first enter the x coordinate, and now we use this sign in order to separate, and now we enter the y coordinate and close the parentheses. This was a little bit far away, so if I zoom out, we see the point here. If I want to show the name of the point, I click here and show label and click on the respective object. Let's use the next one, B. That should be 0 and 2. Again, I want to know the label. And let's say C, which is 4, 0. Also, this one here. Now there is an important part. If I want the side A to be on the opposite side of the point, I should also start with that side. Otherwise I have to rename the sides later. So if I click here on segment between two points, I use the first one as BC and it will be A because I drew it in the first way. Now the second one should be opposite B so I go to AC and the third one AB. Now let's show the labels B and C. Now we have this triangle ABC. The next question or the next problem is to color each side in a different way. Side A should be green so we hover over the side A, click on the right side, go on properties, color, it should be green, so let's just select one green. And we see the side A has green color. The side B should be red, so we hover over B, click on the right side, properties, select the red color, and close. Finally, the side C should be blue. Again, we hover over the side, properties, and blue. So far so good. Now we also want to draw a parabola of a certain function. The function is y equals in parentheses x minus 1 to the power of 2 minus 1. Now we have the parabola here and we see the parabola intersects the triangle twice. In order to find out the intersection points we have done that earlier. We go to this point, say intersect two objects. This one and the side B will give me this intersection point and again this one and the side A. I have the other intersection point. If I want to know the distance between the two intersection points, go here, click distance, 
first point, second point, and there I have it.